Save my bay, guys. Showing you all how you can catch your own life through the crabs for sheep's head bait. Follow along, this ain't an episode you're gonna wanna miss. Go so find some the crab. I think I see one up ahead. Guys, you wanna be fast with this. Oh, I got one. Guys, this is what you gotta do to catch the crab. Oh, a couple more right here. Fiddler crabs really like this muck. Let's go catch some fiddler crabs, guys. After you, of course. Hey, what's up everyone? Anthony here, and on today's episode of Coastline Adventures, I'm gonna be showing you all how you can catch your own live fiddler crabs for sheep's head bait. I've been getting a lot of people asking me how I catch my fiddler crabs. Guys, follow along. This ain't an episode you're gonna wanna miss. Let's go find some fiddler crabs. All right, so to catch these fiddler crabs, guys, number one thing you're gonna wanna look for is location. Right here, guys, you can see I'm in a, like a wooded forest area of mangroves, guys. That's the number one area for fiddler crabs. Now me, I have experience of five years catching crabs, so I got a couple secret spots that I go to and catch them. But the number one thing you're gonna wanna look for, guys, is mangroves. Once you find the mangroves, all you have to do is invest some time, put in some work, find the crabs. That's what we're gonna do today, guys. So let's go get the fiddler crabs now. All right, so to start the fiddler crab hunt, there's a couple things that you're gonna need to catch the fiddler crabs. All I use is a couple buckets, and I don't like getting pinched, so I use a glove. So that's all you need is a bucket and a glove and a good pair of eyes to see these crabs. I'm gonna hop down here, see if I can find some. All right, this looks like a good area for fiddler crabs to hide in these mangroves. I'm gonna hop down, catch some fiddler crabs, guys. All right. All right, guys, here's a couple right here. What you wanna do is you wanna get them as fast as you can, guys. They like to hang underneath these mangroves. There is a couple, here's another one right here. All right, just like that guys, just like that. I got a couple feather crabs. All right, let's keep on moving. Let's go down the line. Like I said guys, you have to invest some work and time, but ultimately you can get the feather crabs. All you do is look at the bottom of the mangrove. All right guys, let's go down and get some crabs. What you wanna do is just hop down, make some noise. Look, we got some right here guys. Come here, get that guy. Catch that guy. Come here, buddy. There's another one right there. Let's see, look guys, there's another one. Oh boy. All right, come here, buddy. All right, he's gone. Guys, you can see what you gotta do to catch these fiddler crabs. Like I said, put some time in, do some work, but it's all worth it. These fiddler crabs really like this muck. Just go grab them nice and gentle into the bucket and just like that a couple minutes of searching I have probably a half dozen fiddler crabs already let's go catch some more all right so guys as you're walking looking for these fiddler crabs always keep an eye on the trees to look for the mangrove tree crabs I spotted a couple right here he's up there guys Oh, I got one, I got one, guys. All right, let me get down here. Yeah. Guys, this is what you gotta do to catch the crabs. Ugh, put them in the bucket. All right, let's keep on going, guys. While you're looking for these fiddler crabs on the ground, you also wanna keep an eye up on the trees here for the mangrove tree crabs. I think I see one up ahead. Guys, you wanna be fast with this. Like that guys here 
Look at these crabs. Look, see right there? Those are two little tree crabs. I got one there. Guys, it's a lot of work. You gotta be fast, put some time in. That's how I catch the crabs, it's no secret. Let's go catch some more. Right now we're gonna walk to the beach, see if we can get a bunch of fiddlers. You can find them in these little baby mangrove vegetations. Come on. Look, I can already see some right here. Got a nice one right here. Got a nice one right there, guys. Put him in the bucket. Ready more? Let's see. There's another, oh, a couple more right here. One, two. Guys, you gotta be fast to catch these fiddlers because they sure love hiding. <laughs> Man. So as these guys can see, there's no secret. Just gotta do some work. Let's go catch some more fiddler crabs. What I'm gonna do now is I have about two dozen fiddlers in here. I'm gonna go put them on the beach so I can come back and catch some more. I see another mangrove crab. Got him, guys. I'm gonna let this one go. Just showing you guys. While you're looking for these mangrove tree crabs, oh, there he goes. While you're looking for the mangrove tree, while you're looking for the filler crabs, always look for the mangrove crabs. All right, guys, when you're on the beach looking for filler crabs, you want to look for these little holes like this. Like, look, here's one right here. Here's one right here. Put him in the bucket. Look, here's another one in this hole, guys. See that? Oh, there's two. <laughs> See that? All right. That's another way to catch the feathers crabs, is go on the beach and look for their little holes. All right, let's keep on catching. All right, well it looks like I made it to the end here of the beach. Let's see what I got. All right guys, catching these uh, crabs, it's not easy. It's not hard, just got to have the spots, put some time in. Look at what I got so far, got about maybe a dozen crabs. Right now I'm gonna leave my bucket of crabs on the beach. I'm gonna head back in and try to catch some more. All right, I'm gonna leave those right there for now. I'm gonna go back in and catch some more crabs. Guys, look at that fiddler crab. He's gonna be good bait. I'm gonna put him in my pot. Oh God, what's that guys? I hear a girl. There's a girl screaming. Guys, I don't know what's going on. I'm gonna go check it out. Sounds like something's wrong. Save my bait, guys. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Man, I sure didn't expect that to happen. I went out catching crabs. I think I ended up giving girls crabs. I don't know how those buckets got spilled over, but man, all right guys, I did manage to save some crabs off of those girls' butts. Come look at this, guys. All those nice filler crabs. <laughs> That's definitely a day of catching crabs that I'll never forget. So my secret to catching these filler crabs, you guys seen it. I have no secret. All it is, man, just put some time in, do some work, <laughs> get your boots dirty. That's how you catch them. I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode, how to catch fiddler crabs for sheep's head bait. I know I enjoyed it. And as always, thanks for watching. Coastline Adventures out. Till next time. Bye. Save my bait.
Thanks for watching. Now go out and catch some feather crabs, but make sure they don't get loose on any girls.